again. Sorry it has been so long since the last time I filmed. Um, but anyway, I went to Chicago for the 4th of July and I got some stuff. So I really wanted to do a haul video for you guys. So let's go ahead and jump on into that. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the shirt that I got first because I have it on. It is from H&M and it's got these cute little lace cap sleeves and a little lace inset right there and it is just um, a scoop neck and it's just like a buttercream yellow color and I just think it is the cutest thing ever so that is the shirt that I picked up the next store that I went to was Lush and this bag has been through the ringer I carried it through the pouring rain and it's paper so it, it doesn't handle rain very well. Um, but this is the first time that I've ever been to a Lush. And I was really, really excited. It was a little overwhelming, to be honest. But I had fun, and I did pick up a couple things in the end. So what I ended up getting, the first thing, which is like a staple, I feel like, for most beauty gurus on YouTube um, is the Lush Lip Scrub. I got it in bubblegum, which I used this the second I got to the hotel, and it is just absolutely amazing. It smells exactly like bubblegum, like a like hubba bubba or something that you can remember from when you were like really little. And I just love this stuff, and I used it, and it was so, so nice on my lips. So I love this. The only other thing that I picked up from Lush was a dusting powder, which was called Vanilla Puff. And what I really like about this is that if you put on lotion and all of that in the beginning of the day, and then you go to work or you go outside, and you get kind of like sticky just because you've been outside all day and you just don't feel super fresh. I like this to just kind of rub on and it gives you a nice smell and then it makes you just your skin so so soft. It is so nice. I really like it. I think it was only like $6.95 which is crazy and this was only $9.95. Um, so for my first experience with Lush it definitely definitely is a really cool store and I really want to go back. I also went to the Forever 21 that was on Michigan Avenue, and if any of you guys know about that Forever 21, it's massive, like humongous, um, and it was very, very busy. I went there on a Saturday afternoon, right after the 4th of July, and it was packed, slammed, actually. So. I didn't get any clothes because I didn't want to go into the fitting room, try stuff on, wait in the massive line, and all of that hoopla that you kind of have to go through when there's a ton of people there. But I did get some necklaces, or a necklace and a pair of earrings. So, um, and they're so, so cute. I have been loving dainty necklaces lately. If you can't tell, I have been wearing my sideways cross one every single day. I haven't even taken it off in like a month. And I picked up, which I think would go so cute along with the sideways cross, and that's just like hearts. It is just the cutest necklace. It's like a half moon shaped almost, and it's just a bunch of hearts that are connected. And I just love it, and it was only $2.80, which is nuts crazy crazy cheap and then I picked up a pair of earrings which I got in gold and they are just the cutest little like knot bows it looks like they're made out of rope but um and they're tied into little bows and it's just so cute and these were also only two dollars and eighty cents which I just think is crazy that's I know that Forever 21's jewelry isn't known to last forever but for less than three dollars Honestly, I don't even care. Like, I can wear these for probably a month, and then if they break, I'm perfectly, perfectly okay with that. $3 for a month worth of earrings is fine by me. So I only went to one more store, or I only bought at one more store. I actually went to a bajillion stores, but um, I got my favorite purchases from this store. The first thing that I got from here is this beautiful new bag and it is massive look look at that it's humongous but anyway 
it's coach and it's just off-white and it's got these really pretty um, leather tassels on it and I just really like it it fits my MacBook in there which is great um, I actually take my Mac to work every single day because um, I'm working on a top secret project on my lunch break so um, it's nice that it fits in there and then my boyfriend surprised me by getting me the wallet that I wanted because I picked up the purse and I didn't really want to spend money for the wallet and the purse and he's like I'll get it for you so I picked out this wallet it is the cutest thing ever like it's a vinyl and it's got the C's all over it which I like when coach bags aren't crazy with the C's like the two-tone C's I'm not the biggest fan of I like either the all leather or if it's tone on tone where you can't see all the C's I'm good with that but anyway this is it it is like emerald green Pantone color of the year and it's got the cutest little vinyl bow and then a little heart charm and it says coach and I just think it's the cutest thing ever I love it really really love it so needless to say you guys will be getting a what's in my bag video soon because I'm obsessed with this thing. Okay guys, so that is everything that I picked up on my Chicago adventure. Um, I hope you all had a great 4th of July. Sorry I have been gone for so, so long. Um, but if you guys have anything that you want to tell me or if you picked up anything great recently or you did anything fun for the 4th of July, let me know in the comments down below. And until next time, guys, don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel. Also, check me out on all my social media sites. It's Katie Does Fashion, KT The Letters Does Fashion. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye, everyone.